Loving your dog isn't all about hugs and kisses and cuddles. Sometimes it's about having tough conversations with your dogs. My daughter's 10 years old, and sometimes I have to have tough conversations with her about the need to eat her vegetables, the need to go to bed at a reasonable hour, the need to do her homework or to get to school on time or, you know, clean her belly button or whatever it is. Sometimes I have to have those more challenging conversations. And right now, she doesn't completely understand why I do challenge her on those situations. But when she turns 25 and becomes an adult and she has really healthy teeth and she has a good sleep cycle and she finished school and she has a good work ethic and all of these other types of things, she's going to thank me. And she's going to see that for the love in which it was intended. The same thing's going to go for your dog. Sometimes you have to have challenging conversations with them about not attacking the neighbor's cat or challenging conversations with them about not bolting out the front door or challenging conversations with them about resource guarding or something like that because these are all potential safety issues. These are all things that are going to destroy their quality of life over time. You can always give your dog love and kisses and cuddles. But it's really important to also show them that you love them by training them and having challenging conversations, even when it's difficult for you.